Well, it may feel like spring right now, but the NHL is preparing to put ice in place at Carter Finley for the big stadium series hockey game in just a few weeks. CBS 17 Storm Team meteorologist Rachel Dunzing is live out there for us tonight. And Rachel, the weather plays a pretty big role in the preparation for this game, right? Oh, yeah. And when I talked to NHL officials earlier today, I made sure to ask them, like, do you know how crazy Raleigh weather can be? You can be 31 day, 60 the next. And they said, yeah, they're aware and they just plan for it. Whoa! Caniacs are ready. Oh, let's go, Canes! Let's go, Canes! For the stadium series against the Washington Capitals. After the outdoor game was delayed two years, the 53 foot trailer housing a giant refrigeration unit was finally parked outside Carter Finley Stadium in Raleigh Monday. So we have two screw compressors that you see right here. We have about 300 tons of refrigeration, so we, we definitely have enough capacity to build the outdoor rink. But even with this powerful refrigerator, building an outdoor hockey rink in the crazy Raleigh weather is sure to have its challenges. Despite that, Derek King with the NHL says they can handle it. It just takes planning. You know, our goal here now is to be ready like the 15th. Uh, big, you know, it's obviously a big game for these teams. So we uh, practice day for them is going to be practice day for us just to fine tune how everything's working. Before they can make ice, they need a solid foundation. Monday after the trailer arrived, workers started laying down armor deck. Once that's finished, they will take days and 20,000 liters of water to flood the field. A lot of the ice making will take place overnight. We'll cover the ice during the day. Um, there's a lot of other things for us to do to get ready for the game. And then once the sun's off the field, we'll, um, we'll uncover and we'll make ice through the night. This is a big setup for a big game. And everyone agrees the effort is worth it. When they, they hear that we're going to do a game outdoors, I think there's, there's a lot of excitement to it. And it's a great stadium, so it's, it's definitely going to be an exciting uh, time for the game. Definitely an exciting time for the game for sure. All right, so here's the thing. Obviously, we love to see the sunshine, but that bright sunshine can help melt the ice. But that's why they have that cover, which is temperature controlled. But because the sunshine can help melt the ice, the fact that our game is at 8 p.m. actually works in our favor. Rain makes things a little bit more complicated, but officials are confident that if any rain falls, they can either refreeze it or squeegee it off the ice. So, you know, they don't have to worry about any uh, worry about any of those issues. But basically, the bottom line, they're going to do whatever they can to make it work. And I think everyone agrees it is worth the wait. They are ready for this game to finally get underway next Saturday, the 18th. Live in Raleigh, meteorologist Rachel Dunzing, CBS 17. The squeegee part I like. I want to see that happen, too. <laughs> I know they don't want it. All right, Rachel, thank you very much. We appreciate it.